Hey YouTubers, this is our next video now. We a uh, medical thriller right now. We're going to talk about now bladder cancer. So uh, basically, cancer of the bladder is interesting because uh, you most people think of it as like a very bad cancer. Not a disclaimer, not a doctor, not giving medical advice. Uh, so many people think this is like a very bad cancer. Uh, there are other types of cancer. They are very bad, like um, I don't know, so like lung cancer or whatever. So or pancreatic cancer. But actually, bladder cancer is interesting because there are many bladder tumors that are very small. They will never spread. They will never cause as much harm, and it's actually um, ironic because bladder cancer parallels or mimics in a lot of ways uh, skin cancer. So uh, there's a lot of ways that um, bladder cancer is similar because a lot of times people get a bladder tumor on one side of their bladder and then another tumor on the other side of their bladder. So uh, the way bladder cancer is treated is typically with surgery and then for more advanced disease, chemotherapy and possibly radiation. So uh, then there's a whole issue of removing the actual bladder itself with, with advanced disease, or they call muscle muscle invasive disease which basically means a person would have to have a permanent bag or urostomy so or permanent uh, neobladder so essentially uh, bladder cancer for the person who has an early bladder stage tumor is generally very good and again I'm not a doctor not giving medical advice so you know, is generally pretty good overall. They probably know somebody with a very advanced bladder cancer can be kind of poor, so especially an older person. <clears throat> and bladder cancer does occur in much older people generally. It's generally a disease of people who are elderly, not a disease of like teenagers, young adults. And predominantly it's caused by smoking, uh, cigarettes, and other types of environmental exposures. They gas the earth life by, it is a fairly common cancer by,